Hello everyone. So here is a demonstration of my uh, Infinite World Generator project updated into Unreal Engine 5.4. So if you don't remember, this is a project that I did some time ago, which infinitely generates a landscape with all the grasses and trees, different types of trees and a sea level and also these animals as well. Uh, no matter where I go, the landscape will be generated infinitely. So here you can see in this demonstration, as I go far away in this world, the land will be generated. So let me just speed up a little bit. You can see so it easily how the landscape is generated as I go far away. And not just that, here you can see animals are also spawned. And also they are pulled in the generation by pulling what i mean is they are reused and replaced around the world as i go further and further in the world so that we don't have uh, much of an overhead generating these animals so yeah but they are just they don't have any specific perception system or anything that I have set up but you can implement them it's just a demonstration I have added here those blue lines shows the locations in the far away where I generate these animals it's just for demonstration purposes you don't really need that in the game and here now let me stop so when I stop you can see nothing is there because everything is generated in the runtime like this And yeah, let me show you this uh, world engine. Here you can see all the parameters that you can use to customize the generated landscape. And I have talked about them in detail throughout these videos that I have implemented from scratch this system. So each and every aspect of this project is explained in detail in these tutorials and other than that here you can see the tile grass spawner so here you can define grass types and based on grass types this is actually supported by the um, procedural foliage tool uh, so you have all the options such as angles scaling then also the ground height range that they will be grow they will grow similarly here you have the animal types that you can define you can have more than one type and for foliage types also here available so you can use all these options to have custom infinitely generated world just in this plugin and you can download the 5.4 updated project in my patreon page i leave the link in the description below and also i will leave this full tutorial playlist as well in the description so if you are interested you can learn from scratch how everything is implemented and feel free to let me know what else what what other features i might add i should add into this series so yeah and thank you.